Patrick Waugh, an iconic figure of Montreal Canadiens hockey, but on December 2nd, 1995, it's a different story. Red Wings Canadians from Montreal, first period, it's Vyacheslav Kozlov with a tap in. Then Kozlov blasts one that Raw can't make the save on, 3-1 Detroit. Late first, Paul Coffey to Stevie Y, the spinning slap pass for Greg Johnson, who makes it 5-1 Detroit after one. Second period on the power play. Red Wings work a tick-tack-toe. Kozlov backhands it past Waugh, who's diving all over the place for the hat trick. Everything going in for Detroit on this night. Matthew Dandino had two goals in this game. Still in the second, a moment hockey fans won't forget. Long shot by Fedorov and a mock chair, and Patrick Waugh responds. He did not appreciate that. And some booze come back at him. Waugh with a sarcastic salute to the Montreal faithful, and Detroit wasn't done. Larionov down low feeds Sergei Fedorov, who buries the one-timer. Waugh finally gets the hook after a career worst nine goals on 26 shots. Back on the bench, Waugh goes over to Canadians president Ronald Corey and tells him that's it. The Red Wings go on to win 11-1 and four days after the incident, the Canadians traded Waugh and Captain Mike Keane to the Colorado Avalanche in exchange for Jocelyn Thibault, Martin Ruchinski and Andre Kovalenko. Raw and the Avalanche would go on to win the Stanley Cup that season. P.K. Subban's trade made headlines, but this was arguably the most controversial deal in Canadians' history.